Hello girls, welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a new video on like a cheaper brand. I got a comment from Sam here who wanted me to choose like a cheaper brand um, and just like test it out. So I decided to go with Alberto um, and I have went with their Sunkissed Raspberry Shampoo and Conditioner. I just sort of thought that this was like the best out of like all of them for my hair because it says that it, it has some silicones for start which is great. Um, it adds moisture, it revitalizes, it has softness and shine improves manageability and everything so I was like this actually might be quite good so I know what it's like whenever you've got all these curly brands and it's really difficult to know like which to buy but then when it comes down to the price it's like it's a bit much sometimes especially when one bottle of conditioner can cost like 20 quid so these were only like 199 I think from like Tesco's it might have even been less so I sort of thought let's give this a go so tonight I'm going to shampoo conditioner and then I'm not sure what standards I'll use but I will figure that out and um, to see what will go with these and then we'll do that so I'm gonna go jump in the shower and let you know <laughs> So as you can see, I've literally just put all my products in, all upside down, and now I'm gonna let this just like soak in for a bit before I plop. And then once I like plop with the, my towel, microfiber sort of like towel, then I'm going to diffuse. Then we'll see what the results look like. So welcome back. This is my hair completely dry. I did it with the diffuser. Uh, it took about 15, 20 minutes or so. Um, and on like a medium sort of like heat. Um, and I've also scrunched out the crunch. So it is nice and fluffy and bouncy. So I'll spin round and show you the results it's actually quite good it's nice and fluffy and like light and everything like it feels really clean um very little frizz as well so yeah like there's literally hardly any frizz i can put in place only thing is the shampoo itself does have sulfates in it i have not used sulfates in such a long time like i'm talking it could be like five to like seven years where I haven't used sulfates. So this is the first time in a really long time I've used it. I really do try to stay away from sulfates. If you're obviously going for the curly girl method, then this is not like the right brand for you at all. It doesn't matter. If you want to go curly girl method, you, you're going to need to invest in stuff. Like the cheapest brand I would say is probably like Share Moisture or something. You know, there's a very good brand that you can do for the curly girl method. But if you're just looking, you know, for like a shampoo that you think is going to work in curly hair, then okay. But there is sulfates in this, so I'm just warning you. Obviously, this conditioner is silicone free, which is great, which I really like about it. But there is alcohol in it, and it's at the very, very top. So remember when you're looking at your, ingredient, your ingredient list, that the higher it is at the top of the list, the more of it that there is. So there's quite a lot of alcohol in that. Um, so obviously, I try to avoid that too. But as for like the shampoo, it lathered up really well. It smelled really, really nice. Um, 
there was no like burning sensation on my head or anything with the sulfate so and the sulfate is like literally the second like thing from the top of the list so there's a lot of sulfate in it um but honestly like I thought it was really good like my hair actually started to um detangle whenever I had the shampoo in which was quite nice and um, so I really liked that as for the conditioner there was a lot of slip I really liked that you could detangle really really easily and um, a lovely smell uh, it says leave it on for one to two minutes which I did however whenever I was getting out of the shower there was a bit of wet frizz but it did sort of like calm down whenever I put my blue clam stuff in as you sing so I'm actually pretty pleased with the outcome of this. Um, like I'm really happy with the way my hair, like it hasn't weighed my hair down, like the conditioner hasn't weighed my hair down or the shampoo. You know, at the minute, I don't know what the sulfate is gonna be like I'm in my scalp. So I'm hoping like tomorrow that my scalp's not gonna get really itchy and start being very red and irritable because that helps me with sulfate. Or that helps me, that happens me with sulfate. So I don't know, like I'll see. And if it does, I'll update you <laughs> like on a part of the video just to let you know. But honestly, like I am really like pleased with the results of this, and I probably like might use it again. Might use the sh the the shampoo, the conditioner again because it seemed quite nourishing. So I, you know, could use that if I really just needed like a quick conditioner sort of to do. I think I'd be happy enough. As for this, I'm gonna see how the sulfates go on my scalp before I make like an actual decision of whether I'd use this again. Um, but so far, guys, like I would recommend it if you're happy enough with the sulfates and you're happy enough with the alcohol like in the conditioner, then I don't see why not. Like if you're trying to save a bit of money with shampoo sometimes and you just sort of like need a quick wash, these are probably like 100% and I think these are probably the most moisturising ones that I could find out of all the brand unless there's a more that I couldn't see in Tesco's and um, but I think I did google it and there's only like a few and um, that you can really choose from and that was the best one for my hair anyway just for like moisturise but honestly my honest opinion like it no my hair turned out like really good and I'm actually so pleased so yeah like obviously stylers are a big thing do you know what I mean like boot claim Stylers are really good with my hair and there's like no protein and stuff in it so you know like I wanted to make sure that I was balancing <laughs> my protein and moisture at the same time. So yes guys um, I am pretty pleased with the results and I would recommend if you're not doing curly girl method but um, if you are then don't go down that route but if you're looking for a cheaper option yeah worked in my hair fine so i hope that, that was helpful for you um remember to subscribe and join the fam bam and thanks so much for watching i shall see you next time see you later bye